Good morning dear students this is Ash Mohammad Khan and I welcome you with today's segment today we are starting chapter 15 and it is related to our environment yes student our environment in the junior classes you have read about it that what is environment yes student what is environment environment means the surrounding of a living being is known as environment and that surrounding may include biotic and abiotic components means in this the biotic components like the living organisms it may be plants animals microorganisms or the human beings they interact with the abiotic components so in this the surrounding of a living being is known as environment and in the surrounding the living components interact with the abiotic components and the science that deals with the interaction of biotic with abiotic components is known as ecology means ecology is the branch of the science in which we study about the interaction of a living being with the no living things like here i have drawn one diagram student it is the diagram of the environment in this there is one human being is surrounded by the different things some are living and some are non living like this student this particular part this half part having plants animals microorganisms and plants and animals and microorganisms are the part of biotic component biotic compo and and the parts that are having air water and soil these are the parts of a biotic components so in the environment in our surrounding there are the different components are found some are from the living organisms that are known as biotic components and some are from the non living substances that are known as abiotic components now student due to the human activities our environment is polluting day by day and that is known as environmental pollution what is the pollution student when the unwanted or the undesirable substances are mixed with the air water soil or they are biological magnified in the living organisms that particular interaction is known as pollution student and when the unwanted substance is mixed with air that is known as air pollution when the unwanted mix with substances mix with water that is known as water pollution when they are mixed with the soil then that is known as soil pollution but when the unwanted or undesirable substances or the chemical substances are mixed with plants animals then that particular phenomena is known as student biological magnification and biological magnification falls the toxic effect on the living organism student means it falls the poisonous effect on the living organisms now our pollution is our environment is polluting day by day due to the pollution student and that pollution is taking place due to the some factors and those factors are known as waste waste there are the two type of waste student and about the waste now we will discuss so student there are the two type of substances that falls the effect on our environment first is the biodegradable substances second is the non biodegradable substances biodegradable substances are the substances or the waste that are originated from the living org organisms means the substances that are originated by the living organisms are known as biodegradable substances and the substances 
that are originated in the industries with the help of different chemical reactions are known as non biodegradable substances biodegradable substances can be decomposed by the decomposer student means generally the organic substances are found in the biodegradable substances and those organic substances can be decomposed into simple organic substances but these non biodegradable substances are obtained from inorganic substances student with the help of different chemical reactions means non biodegradable substances are the man made substances and they are not decomposed by the decomposers and student yes student they cannot be magnified biologically means the biodegradable substances are not magnified in the living organism means they don't fall the adverse effect or the toxic effect on the living organism but these non biodegradable substances are magnified in the living organism via food chain because their concentration is increased according to the trophic levels means first it comes to the producer from the producer it comes to the consumers from the consumer primary consumer it comes to the secondary secondary to tertiary like this it is their concentration is increased and this process is known as biological magnification student and next is student biodegradable substances cause less pollution why do they cause the less pollution student because they are decomposed with the help of decomposers and in this process there is only some amount of the carbon dioxide is released in the environment but these non biodegradable substances cause more pollution means at the time of the manufacturing of the non biodegradable substance they cause the pollution and at the time of the decomposition they also cause the pollution and which pollution they do they do the all the pollution like air water and soil pollution now the example student biodegradable substances are originated from the living organism so the all the kitchen garden and and agricultural waste come in the category of biodegradable substances student agricultural kitchen and garden waste with this student the peels of the fruits and vegetables tea leaves and the leaves they come in the category of the biodegradable substances non biodegradable substances the things that are manufactured in the industries come in the category of comes in the category of in non biodegradable substances so we can say the industrial waste like the fertilizers fertilizers come in the category of non biodegradable like this brick brick come in this category glass metallic cans they all come in the non biodegradable substances with this pesticide insecticide fertilizers they all come in the non biodegradable substances so it is the most important topic student generally it is asked in the exam that write the difference in between biodegradable and non biodegradable this type question come in the exam like this non biodegradable substances are more harmful than biodegradable how so this type of question come in your board exam so you try to learn this important topic thank you very much and have a nice day yes student they cannot be magnified biologically means the biodegradable substances are not magnified in the living organism means they don't fall the adverse effect or the toxic effect on the living organism but these non biodegradable substances are magnified in the living organism via food chain because their concentration is increased according to the trophic levels means 
first it comes to the producer from the producer it comes to the consumers from the consum primary consumer it comes to the secondary secondary to tertiary like this it is their concentration is increased and this process is known as biological magnification student and next is student biodegradable substances cause less pollution why do they cause the less pollution student because they are decomposed with the help of decomposers and in this process there is only some amount of the carbon dioxide is released in the environment but these non biodegradable substances cause more pollution means at the time of the manufacturing of the non biodegradable substances they cause the pollution and at the time of the decomposition they also cause the pollution and which pollution they do they do the all the pollution like air water and soil pollution now the example student biodegradable substances are originated from the living organism so the all the kitchen garden and and agricultural waste come in the category of biodegradable substances student agricultural kitchen and garden waste with this student the peels of the fruits and vegetables tea leaves and the leaves they come in the category of the biodegradable substances non biodegradable substances the things that are manufactured in the industries come in the category of comes in the category of in non biodegradable substances so we can say the industrial waste like the fertilizers fertilizers come in the category of non biodegradable like this brick brick come in this category glass metallic cans they all come in the non biodegradable substances with this pesticide insecticide fertilizers they all come in the non biodegradable substances so it is the most important topic student generally it is asked in the exam that write the difference in between biodegradable and non biodegradable this type question come in the exam like this non biodegradable substances are more harmful than biodegradable how so this type of question come in your board exam so you try to learn this important topic thank you very much and have a nice day